Slick, Oklahoma. Once a bustling boom town of 5,000 people is now a small community with just over 150 residents. Legends of prostitution, gambling, shootouts, and wanted criminals shroud mystery as to the true events that took place here that are still unknown. In 1919, an oil tycoon by the name of Tom B. Slick, who was also known as Mad Tom Slick, Dry Hole Slick, and King of the Wildcatters, secretly drilled a discovery well in search of oil-rich ground, but it didn't take long before others caught wind of Slick's secret. Shortly after his discovery, the town was founded in March of 1920, and a post office was quickly established the month after. Within the next three months, tents and shacks were converted into stores, cafes, pool halls, and other various kinds of businesses with an estimated population of 5,000 people. More oil wells were drilled and the town became a production and shipping center that included a business district and spanned the distance of half a mile. The district consisted of two banks, three hotels, two oil field firms, one cotton gin, one grist mill, several rooming homes, and other forms of commerce. In 1920, the Oklahoma Southwestern Railroad Company had constructed a railroad that spanned 12 miles from Bristow to Slick. A large depot was built to handle crowds of settlers that were in search of black gold. Unfortunately, by the 1930s, it was abandoned just as quickly as it had begun. Less than 500 people remained after a fire had destroyed several stores and other buildings. What survived was closed for lack of business. Over the next 90 years, the population has averaged around 150 people. This is mostly the generation of those that stayed and call Slick their home. Train tracks have been removed, and a few older buildings are all that remain of the old boomtown. As of today, Slick only has one gas station, an event center, and a Baptist church that was once the old depot. If you happen to be passing through, Slick is definitely a place you wouldn't want to miss.